The following is a video to assist you in learning how to install the LineGuard product manufactured by CritterGuard. The LineGuard is installed on overhead power lines. It is the most effective product on the market that is designed to block excess of squirrels and other rodents from gaining access to equipment that cause damage and creates power outages. It further protects raptors, birds of prey, from electrocution when coming in contact with energized lines. The line guards are shipped in a four-pack box or in a single-pack box. The components of a single line guard will be packaged in a durable, clear, sealed plastic bag. The components are ten roller halves that, when assembled, make five rollers and two wheels that fit onto the end rollers. Inside the larger bag will be a smaller bag containing two L-brackets, two conductor clamps, six stainless steel ties, and a printed set of instructions. Determine the diameter of the line where you will install the line guard. If and only if the line is thicker in diameter than one inch will you need to trim the end opening of each roller half. The standard opening is one inch. If applicable, use a sharp blade to enlarge the openings. There are markings on the inside of each roller to provide you a guide. You want the rollers to spin freely around the line. Prior to installation on the conductor, partially assemble the five rollers by snapping together only one side of each roller. Locate the matching guide pins and holes along the edges of each roller half. Snap and lock only the four snaps on one side so that you can separate the other side. We are now ready to position the first L bracket on the conductor. For substation applications, place the line guard at least five feet outside the substation fence. For other installations, place the line guard two feet out from the pole or standing structure. Place the first L bracket on the underneath side of the conductor with the slotted openings along and parallel to the conductor pointing toward the substation, pole, or structure. Secure this first L bracket to the conductor using two stainless steel ties threaded through the slots and one conductor clamp placed between the slotted openings. Ensure the L bracket is tightly secured against the line to prevent it from sliding up or down the line. You are ready to position the five rollers around the conductor. Wrap the open side of the roller around the conductor, lock together each of the four opposing snaps, and repeat for all five rollers. Next, position the two wheels on the end roller. Use the slot to get the wheel over the conductor. Slide the center opening of the wheel over the end of the roller. The locking tabs and wheel keepers will hold the wheel in place. Further secure the wheel by closing the slot with a stainless steel tie near the bottom. Do this on each end roller. Slide all five rollers with attached wheels next to the initially installed L bracket. The final step is to install the second L bracket as you did the first one. Make sure the smooth, flat surface rests against the fifth roller and that all rollers spin independently without binding. This concludes the installation of your no access line guard from Critter Guard. Thank you for your attention and learning how to install this impassable barrier.